Hello everyone, it is Nikola Petkovic, your local real estate guru. It is a little bit windy on my balcony right now here at the 60 Absolute Avenue in Mississauga, but it's a beautiful sunset as you can see. It is time for another condo market report for the month of September 2021. Stay tuned and watch the video. Hello again, everyone. Thank you for watching this video. Monday, October 18th, 2021. Um, and it is time for another Square One Area Condo Market Report. Probably you noticed I'm in a little bit different setting uh, for this video as I'm recording it from the coziness of my condo here at uh, 60 Absolute Avenue, Square One Area City Center, Mississauga. So if you have been watching my videos previously, uh, you are aware of the charts and the statistics that uh, we are monitoring uh, month over month. Um, I'm going to dive into numbers right on. So in this one, you can see a blue line, which is representing 2021 and the red one um, that is representing 2020. Um, and as you can see here in the blue line, in the last couple of months, the number of condos that have been sold in a square one area has been very flat. We're looking at 129 condos sold in June, July 135, August 127, and in September last month, 132 condos got sold. It's been steady, it's been flat, nothing significant was happening there. Uh, but um, in my next chart, and this is something that I do randomly. Um, I'm checking what is the inventory, or how many condos are available at that specific moment for sale. And this is not sole conditional. This is just um, new listings and listings with a price change. And as you can see here, um, the line has decreased uh, from the last time. Uh, the numbers have been decreased from the last time when I did the check. And what is this telling us? Well, because we were having um, the same flow of new listings in the market. This is definitely telling us um, that um, October, it seems that the market is absorbing listings faster and um, that uh, more condos are being sold at the moment automatically, more buyers in the market, but I'm gonna jump into that in a second. Um, this chart is showing us how long it takes for an average condo to get sold in the city center area in Mississauga. And as you can see here, this number has jumped uh, from 16.4 to, um, uh, to approximately 20 days on the market. So now um, compared to the previous chart that we saw, um, these numbers do not match. Um, how come more condos are being sold, but, but there is less inventory, but it takes more for an average condo uh, to sell? Why did this number go up? And there is a simple answer for that. I did take a closer look because the numbers didn't make sense. And um, the reason why um, it takes a little bit longer uh, based on the average number, uh, just because the square one market, it's, it's, it's not big. We cannot compare to the number of sales. Uh, and uh, for example, downtown Toronto, where we have all those high rise buildings, a lot of transactions in the condo market. So uh, this market is smaller. And then if we have just a couple of properties that took a little bit longer than usual to sell, this is why we have um, this jump in the number of, of days that it takes for, for average condo to sell. Um, what happened, five or six units uh, based on what I've seen took a little bit longer to sell. And that's why these numbers messed up a little bit. Uh, for those condos, it was approximately 80 to 150 days to sell. And for those couple of transaction, transactions, this number is a little bit higher. Nothing to worry about. Uh, in the next chart, we're looking listing to sold ratio. Um, those numbers have been flat also in the last few months. Uh, as you can see here, September, um, Average condo is selling for 0.86% higher 
than what it was listed for. So let's say like it's, it is definitely selling for approximately the same amount that is listed for. And for that reason, uh, I always advise uh, sellers, uh, make sure that you're working with a professional, local, hyper real estate agent who will be able to evaluate your property properly. Um, and um, the reason why is based on the statistics most likely the amount of uh, money what you listed for that's what you're going to get so make sure that you list your properly your property um accordingly with the market trends and as i said use a professional um, who will be able to assist you in the best possible way and let's jump into the most exciting numbers for this month get ready for this uh we're right now in a broker bay this is the platform um, this is the biggest platform for scheduling showings in a GTA. And as you can see here, I'm focusing only on Mississauga area and condo apartments. And look at this trend in the last few weeks. The number of showings that are being booked is constantly going up. And this is the first sign that buyers are going back in the market um, as more showings are being scheduled. So if we compare to last month, uh, exactly one month ago, uh, September 19th, you can see that the number of showings has increased approximately 40%. Uh, so approximately 40% more buyers are in the market right now compared to just a few weeks ago. And that's not the only thing. The most exciting part about this chart is that the last week, October 10th, 2021, was the peak of this year. As you can see here, um, this is the highest number of showings so far this year in the Mississauga area and in the condo market. So this is super exciting. Um, if you are a seller now, it might be the right time to put your property for sale. If you are a buyer, um, definitely should be moving the needle forward and um, uh, securing a deal because if these trends continue and as you can see that the um, uh, inventory is shrinking uh, and if there are more and more buyers in the market automatically this means that you will be competing with more people in order to secure the deal same thing applies for investors investors are usually the first one to notice these trends clearly they're working with a professional agent um, and if you were planning to invest uh, based, as I said, on the trends that we're seeing at the moment, it is going to be a good timing to pull the trigger and to seal the deal. Um, if you have any questions or thoughts, if you're looking to buy, sell, or invest in the Square One area, please feel free to reach out. My email address is nicola at condos.ca. Um, send me a detailed email. Let me know what your thoughts are, and I will be reaching out to you as soon as possible. Thank you again for watching this video. Have a lovely day. I'm super excited uh, to present you my next market report is going to be happening in a few weeks. Cheers. Bye-bye for now.